Yeah, so I'm Emma and I play uh, right back for Wickham Wanderers Women. So Emma, what sparked your initial like, love of football? Uh, I've played since I was five, so been in the game for a while. I'm turning 30 in a couple of weeks' time, uh, so do the maths there. Uh, but my love for football came from my family, so uh, my family are big football fans. And yeah, just growing up in a football household, really, watching the football, going to games, things like that. So with the Euro wins, do you think, is this like the best year ever for like, English women's yeah. football? Yeah, definitely. I mean, off the back of that, there's a whole hype around women's football, which is really great. Um, it's been on the rise for a good few years, but I think, you know, not just the football, the women's rugby as well, the cricket, you know, it's, it's on the rise for women in, in general, which is good. Cool. And then how do you think that Wickham Wanderers encourage more like, children and uh, women to get into football? So we've got a Wickham Wanderers set, which is the charity side of the club. Um, and they go out and they coach children and I think they're making links with uh, the club here as well. Uh, they've got like a girls elite um, development coming up. Um, but yeah, in terms of our role, uh, we go to the Wickham Wanderers games and we try and you know, get as many girls involved. We give out free tickets and we've done some penalty shootouts and things like that. So just getting our name out there and trying to get more girls involved in the sport. Nice. And then how does sort of sponsorship like you know obviously we're a sponsor of the team, like how do you think that kind of helps sort of benefits like the team? All of our kit is funded and our training and it allows us to train to the intensity that we do and play here, which is amazing. Nice. And then last question, what shows or films are you looking forward to streaming this Christmas? Uh, I can't wait to watch The Grinch <laughs> for the hundredth time coming. Um, yeah, but anything that's Christmassy I'm up for it, so <laughs> My name is Shauna and I play left wing back or right wing back. So Shauna, what sparked your love of football? Um, just the competitiveness and um, just the fact that my mum used to play it so it makes me love it even more just to you know, follow in her footsteps. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, what do you think is like special about the uh, Wickham Wanderers show girls? Um, just the whole of the team, like the girls are all like friendly and uh, the togetherness everyone has, like they support each other, and that's what you need in a football team, I guess. It makes you feel like you belong and like you're not an outcast, so it's good. So, what films or shows are you looking forward to streaming this Christmas? Elf, they're, they're always the best films to watch. Or the holiday for Christmas Eve, it's even better, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm Emily Strange and I'm 13 goalkeeper. So, Emily, with the Euros win, is this like the best year ever for women's football? Definitely, I think it's finally got more recognition that it needs and I think it's been really important and just the growth of women's football is just going to exceed and I think that's really good for where we are now. Um, and what has been the best moment of the year for the chair girls? Um, definitely playing at Adams Park. I think that's just such an amazing opportunity to be playing for them and then to play on the main pitch is just a dream to be honest. So have you got any really painful stories about when you're halfway through something and the internet cuts out? Uh, I think I was doing my school work, I was doing my coursework and um, power cuts so yeah. It took me a couple of little while to find it again. So I'm Katie Riddington, I play as an inside forward mainly on the left but I can play down the middle on the right, I can play most positions really. So Katie, uh, what do you think, like what makes the chair girls like a special team? I think it's so special because there's such a mix. I mean, we've got, I mean, some older players, some younger players, players coming through the pathway. I mean, yeah, I think everyone brings something different to the table, which I think is great. I mean, we've not got the same personalities across the board, so everyone's different in their own way. And who would you say are your like football heroes, guys or girls? Probably Ellen White. I mean, watching her as a forward, her movement in the box. I don't know. She just. Something special, really. Just have you ever met her? Yeah, I have quite a few times. And then, how do you think sort of Wickham Wanderers encourage more girls and like young people to get into football? So I know that they're setting up like a college program, so that's hopefully going to entice more girls into the program. Sponsorships, like what you know, Swish obviously yeah. sponsor the team. What do you think that kind of like brings the team? Or how does that help the team? I think it helps hugely. I mean, we're pretty self-funded, so with people sponsoring us, it really takes a load off of us players. You know haven't got to think about any financial situations and yeah it's really helpful. My name is Shante Innes and I'm one of the strikers. Uh, what do you think has been the best moment of the year so far for the show girls? Um, best moment of the year I would say playing at Adams Park was great. It's a really good experience to play there. 
and I got the first goal for the for the game as well. So I was quite chuffed. So who would you say you're like football heroes? One would be Cristiano Ronaldo. Uh, a girl was joining you know, Chad Girls this year. What, yeah. what advice, if you had one advice they would give her, what would it be? I'd say be yourself, always be yourself, and enjoy it. Play with a smile. Uh, how does fast internet help you sort of stay connected with like you know, your loved one? Yeah, obviously keeping in contact and yeah, video calls and sending messages, instant messenger. Thank you to Swish Fiber for sponsoring us. It's great. Cheers.